So what could they possibly throw at you in Alaska to make it as difficult as it was in the console version? I don't really want to know, but let's try it out. Super expert, wonderful. Whole three and a half kilometers of pure pain. And see if it's really as bad and if it looks like what's name. Use it, what's this? Uh, for some reason I basically I pretty much forgotten about this music actually. Everyone's going way ahead of me for some reason. Here we go. I was about to say, well darn then we actually have a uh, like walls on the track. This is already like well, yeah, still a lot more tame than it is in the actual console version. There we go. That's something. Excellent. Still is a lot more tame, but oh well. There's lots of ice in some places, I guess. Excellent. I forgot, yeah, for some reason, I said earlier, a couple episodes ago, that this game actually had one song. I was kind of tired of hearing it. It has more than one song. The gameplay. I just forgot about it for some reason. Just barely. I was actually slowing down so I could let Kyora catch up to me, I could knock her down. Oh, what's all the trick boost? I was like to be somewhere other than 5th. I think I'll change it in just a moment. So many jumps, that's nice. The ground looks weird in this portion. And we ought to be good. Alright, never managed to pull that off in Ice Jam, but Alaska is apparently my friend. Speaking of which, actually, <laughs> friendliness. This is a really friendly music you're playing in Alaska. Alaska doesn't really feel like a <laughs> threatening place in this <laughs> version of the game at all, does it? Okay, Simon, where are you? Okay, there we go. Simon has sometimes, just sometimes, Simon will pull way ahead of the pack. And then other times, people will be finishing at the exact same frame as each other, so... I don't really know what to make of all that. Anyways... Man, I got some serious air off of that. Well, air time at least. Keep going, dude. It's a lot to it once you just get it for boost, is there? And it's not like there's actually a lot of variation in the terrain or anything. I thought there would actually be some hazards and whatnot, like some of the really annoying branches and whatnot we used to find in Garibaldi. I'm happy those aren't making their appearance again, but... Okay. Yep, destroyed everyone by 20 seconds. It's all about just getting that first... knockdown so I can get some boost. And then trying to carry my momentum from there. It's like half tricky. And an Uber Shirker under my belt. Am I under the impression that cutting corners in this game actually lets you get ahead of anybody? I don't think that's how this engine works. Eddie, I understand that you have, have literally the worst stats in the game, but come on. Please, catch up. Do it somehow. For example, through the fact that these people are actually jumping and losing speed in midair, whereas you're not. You should be catching up to them. I used to be able to catch up to people do by doing this. I guess infinite boost is not what's going to be happening today. Okay. After an infinite boost not being on the agenda today, we can at least try for something a bit better than nothing. There are lots of jumps here, actually. Actually, yeah, Alaska as a whole is surprisingly plain. And not that plain isn't a pretty apt way of describing pretty much every track in this game, but this one feels surprisingly vanilla compared to others. Oh, also just... Wait, why? Compared to what I 
know Alaska has in the console version. Kind of builds that expectation. Right, and... Right, not a lot of track left, so I need to get going. And the thing is, once you have boost, it's not too hard to gain on people at all. Who? Why do they have so much air? Who was it that, in the way in the sky, in the corner of the screen? Get, get, get going, dude. If you bump into a wall, though, you just good deal of speed, and even if boost, it takes you some time to regain all that. There we go. Not as good as last time. Yeah, and despite taking so much longer to get infinite boost, I only lost two seconds of time. That's weird. And then, of course, people were way closer to my tail that time than they were before. This time it's going to be excruciatingly difficult to. My god, look how far ahead they get at the beginning. This time it's going to be excruciatingly difficult to actually. I'm not going to go down to get myself going. I do everything I can. But this game is only willing to offer so much. But I can figure out how to do that one thing I did once where I somehow just like skipped a jump entirely. I just teleported from the lip of the ramp to the ground. I can always, if I just keep doing that, that would be amazing. See, that, that keeps your speed up wonderfully. I should so far ahead. What? Eddie, what? How? How do you manage to rotate that far? So far you're laying on your face in a fraction of a second. You don't have good tricks, Ted. You're not in any way, shape, or form equipped to actually rotate quickly enough to make that happen. How? What? 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 Ugh. Why? Come on. This is an odd choice of music for Alaska, honestly. I'm trying to hug corners as if it's actually going to help in some way or form, form. Yeah, I just get fall way behind. I get no boost for that either. I probably wasn't doing rotations, but it doesn't really help much when I do. Yeah, so note to self, never do tricks. I think that, I, I don't know if the idea is actually to trail these guys until you can knock them down, or if they actually want you to be doing tricks so you can get some boost and catch up to these guys. The thing is, if you actually jump to do tricks at all, then you don't have, and then you fall behind, and you don't get enough Okay. Boost his compensation to actually make up the ground you lose for having been in the air. Get that actually. Well, that was peculiar. I guess I should actually have been paying a bit more attention to the fact that there were trick boosts here, though, because I could use those to get some speed or to get some boost off of a previous trick. This will let me do a way bigger trick than usual. So if I do something like that, then hopefully I'd get enough boost from that that I'd actually be able to catch up to somebody. Not at all, actually. Yeah, not even enough to make up the difference for having done a trick. Like, the fact that I jumped put me behind everyone by a pretty good margin. But then rubber banding might have saved the day. No, it didn't. There we go. Wasn't knocking him down, man. Tricky. 
they still have to go hungry for jumps in this place. Plenty of those to satisfy you. How oh, far ahead are these guys? Alright, keep going, dude. Build up the last of that boost. Don't worry your head off. Run DMZ. It's okay. We have plenty of ramps. And just one more, and we'll be pretty close to the finish line, actually, despite me being fourth. Alright, update 8 miles per hour. Back through time. Zooming past everyone, actually. Shoo. And goodbye to Kaori, hopefully. Hitting a wall, that's not good. Can't lose much speed off that, actually. Okay. No! Ah! Seriously! Oh, shut up. Oh, come on! Ugh. So I'm not entirely sure I actually made happen there either. Like, did I just manage to like abuse the game's or abandon in such a way that they I slowed or I was behind, so everyone in front of me slowed down. So then when I caught up, rather, so then I was actually able to catch up. Maybe that's what I should try to do. Like, do a trick to like, gain some speed. Or maybe do, do, do two tricks. And then use that boost in conjunction with the fact that everybody ahead of me is going to slow down as a result of me falling behind. And then I can... Actually, I'm honestly not sure this game has rope banding. Actually, not completely convinced of its existence in this game. Like, I fall behind here, and people are actually going to be a good deal ahead of me. It's going to actually take me some time and effort to catch up to everyone again. Look how long it's taking me to catch up to these guys now. Gives you a lot of boost though at least. I didn't even see Marisol. I didn't notice myself passing up or anything. Okay. So that actually worked a good deal, it looks like. Calm down. Come on! I finally managed to screw up a trick here. Apparently the holy grail of tricks, though. Getting two of those. What? There we go. Okay. And I don't have. Yeah, I don't have enough time left to actually consider doing. Oh come on! There's not enough of that track left at that point, though, for me to consider actually taking a legitimate approach to that, though, and getting um, infinite boost. So let's do that. Get some boosts. Actually, no, I don't even need to do that. I think that's a waste of time, actually, doing a trick there. I, the ch boost I earned back is not enough to even get me back to where I was before I did the tr trick. So I'm gonna do it instead, so I'm gonna trail them, like usual. But when I get to the trick boost, I'll 
do what I said I was going to try to do earlier, actually. And I'll just get tons of boost off of that instead. I'll use that to catch up with him, because I know I can get tons of boost off of that. Okay, using that. So that gives me a pretty huge amount of boost. Well, compared to what I normally get in this game at least. So penance I usually get. Okay. Even with me boosting, it is so difficult to catch up to these guys. Wow. Seriously, these guys in the third heat are ridiculous. Speed boost, please. Ramp, please. Okay. Half of it. Fifth, of course, but something. Just one more, and we'll be able to have our fun. And that should be good. Alright, on my way, Marisol. Why did I get slowed down by trying to hit you? I slowed down so much. Did not need that. Alright, come on, you two. JP, you French freak. Naomi. Naomi, Kyori. Rather you not. Really rather you not. turns right after. No! No! Of course I get bumped right at the end. We're at the end now. Okay. <laughs> I almost acted too soon. Seriously though. All those little bumps at the end. All those jumps right before walls. Or right before sharp turns and we hit walls. Ugh. Okay. So that then is it for this episode. <laughs> So next time we'll have some fun with the, uh, fun quote unquote, with show off in Alaska. We'll see what we have to make of that too. Okay. See ya guys.